this moment, I'm going to show you how to draw different shapes using the paint.net program. So first, click on the start button or the windows button and then find the paint.net program. Then, okay, to open the paint.net, you just click it with your mouse. Ta-da! Welcome to paint.net main window. So now, to draw some shapes, let's choose the shapes button. Okay. And then, after choosing that, okay, on the second row of the toolbar, okay, this one, on the second row of the toolbar, okay, can use our shape type. Okay, let's choose rectangle. Okay, then after that, we should choose our <clears throat> primary and secondary colors. So, in primary, I will just choose red. And for the secondary, I will choose blue. Okay, so we're done with our prime. We're done choosing our primary and secondary colors. Let's go to brush to with. Let's just change our brush to with in the size number seven okay so now since we're done we're ready to draw our first rectangle okay so now you should click and drag the left mouse button on the drawing page okay so again let's just click and drag in. So now we have a hollow rectangle. Okay, hollow rectangle. Now, what if you want to put colors inside the rectangle? Okay, so we'll just, okay, on the second row of the toolbar, let's choose the, let's just click the shapes button in here. And then just click on the drop down arrow and then you'll we will just click on draw field shape. So ta da okay. It is filled with color red. Okay. So if in case you want to to have a to have an outline, we just click on the shapes button and then choose the draw field shape with outline. Okay, ta -da. So our secondary color will become our um, field color. So our primary color is will become our outline. Okay, so... Okay, done with the rectangle. Okay. So, let's click the undo button. Okay, this is the undo button or the undo arrow. And then now, let's draw a square. Okay, so how to draw a square? Okay, so click on the, rec click on the shapes button and then rectangle shape type rectangle and then press shift okay as you drag the as you drag your mouse in the drawing page hold on to the shift shift key on your keyboard shift key okay so you will have a perfect square okay so just hold on to your shift key keyboard shift key and then ta -da! as you drag it oh okay so as you drag it you will have a oh wait just me I should drag you should you should just hold your shift Okay, so it won't be 
rectangle, okay? So, hold the shift key. Press it. And then, ta-da! Done with your square. Okay. Again, this is the hollow square. So, again, if you want to put colors inside or if you put, uh, if you want to, your square will be filled with colors inside. So, you just go to sh click on the shapes button and the second row of the toolbar and then ta -da! then again if you want to put an outline okay you just select draw field shape with outline okay so again your secondary color will be field color will be in the field color and your primary color will be on the outline color okay so next we will draw um other shapes like ellipses circles and other shapes okay so now let's click on the undo button Okay, so again, it's ready. Okay, so if you want to draw ellipses, circles, or other shapes, again, just click on the shape type. On the second row of our tool toolbar, click on the shape type. And then, choose ellipse. Okay, first we will just... um ellipse so we'll just draw ellipse okay so now click and drag your mouse on the drawing page yeah. perfect ellipse okay so our ellipse is hollow okay okay ellipse is like an oblong it's like oblong okay or oval okay now if again if you want to to put a field color on that center in the center part of your ellipse you just click on the shapes button and then draw field shape Ta -da! then again if you want to have it with an outline click on draw field shape with outline okay that's how you draw an ellipse okay so click on the undo button and then next we will draw a circle okay just click on the ellipse and then drag your mouse Ayan. So that is a perfect hollow circle. So again, just like the other shapes that we we have draw, click on the shape shapes button and then draw field shape. Again, if you want to draw draw the shape with an outline, if you want your circle shape with an outline, just click on draw field shape with outline. Okay, and that's it. And then next, okay, we're done with ellipse circles. And now let's try to draw the other shapes. Okay, so first we should click on the undo button. And very good. So now we're ready. Again, click on the shape type. And then choose um any call any shapes that you want. Okay, let's say heart. Okay, heart. Okay. Okay. Now we have a hollow heart shaped. Again, if you want to, just like the other shapes that we have drawn. Okay, click on the draw field shape. 
so and, and then if you want our shape to have an outline then click on draw field shape with outline okay so next let exp let's explore another other shapes okay let's have star Okay, we have a small star. Okay, click on the undo button. Okay, so the color of star is, of course, it is yellow, right? Yellow. So, we will choose yellow as our primary and secondary color. Okay, yellow. So, now... Okay, we already chose our shape type, so now we're ready. Okay, click on the page, drawing page, and then drag your mouse. Okay, that's it. We have a hollow star shaped, right? And if you want to fill it with a color, Okay, again, just like the other shapes, click on the shape, shapes button, and then draw, click on the draw field shape. So our star is being filled. And if you want to have an outline, okay, just click on the draw field shape with an outline. So, and it's not that clear, but. Okay, yeah, it's clear now. Okay, so. Okay, next. Okay, we will uh, draw a rounded rectangles. Okay, so first. Okay, again, let's uh, click or choose our primary and secondary color. Okay, again, our primary color will be red. And our secondary color, I will just use blue. Okay. Now, let's go to shape type. Or click on the shape type. And then, let's choose rounded rectangles. Okay. This is very easy. Okay. Okay, now we're ready. Okay. Uh, click on the drawing page and then drag it with your mouse. Okay, now we have a hollow rounded rectangle. Okay, again, if you want to put a sh field color, just click on the shapes button and then click on draw field shape. Okay, so that's it. And then again, if you want to have an outline, okay, to have it, okay, just again, click on the shape draw field and then click the draw field shape with an outline. Okay, so that's it. Okay, thank you.